Here's the block of candy that we just did this week. Who are we getting back to? Hey guys, Chubbs Dub C coming at you. How are you today? How are you today? Don't mean to have my sunglasses on in my intro here, but now that I've introed, hey, how are you? I'm gonna put my mic on. Hope you guys are doing good. Hope everything's good with all y'all back in the States. Hope Minnesota surviving the snowstorms they've been getting. Uh, weather here is about 86. Little overcast right now. Uh, <laughs> we don't get much in the way of rain anymore. It might be just a quick sprinkle. But honestly, we don't... Uh, this is like the drier season, but it's also the little bit more moderate climate season. 85, 86, not as humid, not the dew points that we used to have here. I think we were running 79% uh, dew point, 96% humidity levels here. I don't think it's that, I'll look. I may add it if I'm right, if I'm wrong, I'm not gonna add it. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we're gonna do a little walk and talk today here for a little bit. I wanna tie, uh, tie up some loose ends. First of all, you gotta see my apartment building. We got some guys working on a unit there, two bedroom floor level, pool level. They're just fun guys. I always stop in to see the construction because I, you know, I'm very interested in construction, as you know. So we're gonna take a look at these cats real quick and show you what I, show you what's going on. Hey guys! Hey guys. Okay, hey guys. Jesus, Stan, these jeepney guys are nuts. You can hear that cat two miles away with that tailpipe rattle. But anyway, take a look at these uh, construction guys in my building here. After I do my extensions, I race back to my apartment. And I like to tuck away my passport, my monies, my whatever I take with me in my safe. And I don't go travel too much with those important documents. They kept my passport, but everything else. I like to make it quick, get back and lock it down. Cool. Let's take a peek in here. Let's see how they're doing in here. Hey guys! Hey, hey! How's the progress? Look at this, the new floor is in everybody. I think we're recording. Yes, we are, you're on. Look at the new shelving. They bumped the cabinets up. They're doing the backsplash and the backsplash is done. Oh, wow. I don't know if you've been following along, but this is uh, quite an undertaking that they have done. New base, new trim work. <laughs> Looking good. <laughs> Looking good, you guys. Hello, hello. How are you? What are you doing? Are you doing the woodwork? You're doing the spack lane stuff? Okay, he's filling the holes. Electrics in. Walls patched. Yeah. Oh, look at the bathroom. Bathroom tiles done. Wow, I like this. I like this. And it is textured. This is quality tile. Ooh, look at the shower. Look at that. Very nice. Nice construction. Very good work, you guys. Very good work. Uh, what do you do? Are you napping in here? What are you? <laughs> Oh, you're doing the bait? You you put it on? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then that gentleman over there is puttying and spackling. Nice. Looks good. Looks good. Watch your page in YouTube, sir. I said. I will tell you here. I will show you here. Pretty neat, huh, guys? This one has been rented, though. I guess this one is spoken for. So, unfortunately, you're not going to be able to move in this one. And I'll always update you if there is an opening. So, stay tuned. Look at I-5, they finally got this thing done. I-5 car rental has been down here underneath for, for a bunch of months. And if you followed some of my vlogs, you've seen them working on this up there and they're always sanding and sheetrocking and making a big mess. So car rental was down here washing his cars like every single day for about two months it seemed. I felt bad for them, you know, but that's just the price around here. They don't contain their dust, they just sand and let that shit fly around here. Well, whatever. So yeah, I wanted to touch base on another thing with you guys. I'm sure you're interested to know. My subscriber base has jumped. 
Uh, I'm up to about 2,548 at the time of this vlog. A uh, big help to that was Philly in the Philippines, Brian, Philly Brian helped out. After uh, we did that interview on his channel, I jumped up, you know, a couple hundred subscribers within a day. Well, since then I've grabbed another 600 or so in the last, you know, 28 days. I think I'm running about an 850 new subscriber mark, which I think is pretty darn good. You know, a thousand a month or a little bit shy of that, it's a nice number. As for expectation, expectations for myself, you know, I didn't really set any other than two year plan. This has got to work or I got to go back to work. You know, and it's been turning out, it's been doing great. You can see that the money is up over $300 a month now. Now that money you figure fluctuates. It's in the last 28 days. So after I talked to you last time, I told you it was like 300 a month. It dropped back down to like 260. Uh, there was a portion where the videos weren't doing so well. This is the game you play, right? And then now, since Brian's uh, interview, I gained a bunch of subscribers. I've gained almost a thousand in the last month. So the views are going up. Plus I'm adding a woman to my channel, Mrs. Ann. Miss Ann, how are you girl? Shout out. Um, that's helping. Plus, you know, walking streets always gonna help. Hotels reviews are gonna help. So I'm playing the game and I'm learning what to shoot, what people are interested in. I hear all you guys to say, get off a of walking street, get out and move on to something else. Hey, I'm not ready for that yet. My mother always tells me that, you know, you'll, you'll do it when you're ready. And I'm just not ready for that yet. You know, I'm, I'm still experiencing and meeting people and there's a lot to shoot around here. Ever say, everybody says this town is washed up. It's not what it used to be. Well, I, I don't believe that. I think this town will always evolve with what the circumstances are, or the state of the union is during the, you know, whatever right now. I've seen a huge pickup in the last three months since I've been here. So I know you guys, a lot of you like to say it's not like it used to and that was the best time of my life and it, it's you know it, it will probably never happen again well consider who's here now and if this is their first time being here this is probably the best time of their life so in 20 years 30 years they're gonna probably be saying the exact same thing of this crew that's standing on walking streets and in Angeles City you know in 30 years saying hey it's, you should have seen me back in 2022 I mean it was crazy you know just like you guys are telling us from back in the 70s 80s whatever uh, even in the early 2000s you know so it's just relevant to who's here and the time frame that you're in it you know I'll look back at this time and say in 20 30 years that it, 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 it's not the same from when I was here but I got a little off track here We're going to, I didn't tell you yet, but we're going over to SM Mall. I got a couple things I need to pick up. We're gonna cut through uh, Main Gate Terminal here. I believe I'm getting the names right. Look at this place, huh? Jesus, people. Look at this place. So anyways, back to the uh, YouTube numbers, you know, goals, sure I have goals. I have a goal of like 10,000 subscribers within a couple years to give me a real basis as is this going to work or not. I think that'll be a good number, a good monthly income number um, to base off what we're going for. And I don't know how long it's going to take, but we're going to figure that out. If it takes too long, like I said, I got to go back and work. I don't want to go back and work. We just gotta make it work. We gotta figure out the right target audience or whatever. Uh, that's a term somebody had thrown at me here not too long ago and I, I don't really have a target audience. I just wanna build a base and I wanted to start here. I'm in no rush. I'm retired, you guys. Watch out. Get hit. Royce. Look at Royce here. That's where we just came from. Jeepneys. Now we're in the little bit bigger buses section. 
Uh, and then there's always trikes. That's the real main gate terminal right over there. We're gonna bypass this, go up these stairs, shoot down the skywalk, get into the second level of the mall. studio throws at you are really interesting. I can check out the analytics. I know that my subscriber base, I know the age groups of the people that watch my channel. And if you look at it here, I think the majority age group is 45 to 69 or something. I don't know, I'm butchering them, but I don't have the stats in front of me right now. But then I also know that about 50% of my subscribers are from the US. It's another screen there. You know, so these analytics, if you can get these analytics figured out and you can work them to your advantage, well, then you're golden. So we're getting it figured out. YouTube is like a, like I said, it's a fun game of win and lose. Right now, right now, guys, I think I'm winning because I'm sure having fun. Numbers are going where they need to go. Spending time with some beautiful women. Experiment with who and what's and whatever to vlog on. I think I'm winning. What the hell was that? Pterodactyl? Oh, light. Oh my god. It's almost Christmas, isn't it? Oh my god. This is like Wednesday, too. Oh, I can feel the air conditioning. There's like a level. I just went through like, oh, it's getting cooler. This, the lower I go, the cooler it gets. This is pretty cool. Finally, after about five trips to this place, I'm getting, getting it figured out. I know where things are located. Uh, you know how to get around this place and not get lost first time i was here holy shit, was this overwhelming but it was so refreshing too because it's a mall if you know anything about minnesota minnesota's got the oldest indoor and closed mall in the world i think it's a world i don't know at least the united states both in like 65 and then they got the mega mall which is the largest mall in the united states or at least it was for many years i don't know about it anymore so I know malls. This one was pretty easy to figure out, not get lost in. I really need to uh, say thank you to all my subscribers, all my new subscribers, all my old subscribers. I don't mean to ever look overlook you guys, you who make my channel. So again, thank you. Thank you for following along, jumping on board. Uh, I must say, you are a great group of people. I may have one comment a month that I might have to toss out. But um, it's been great. This is all food. I want something different than that. So again, yes, thank you. Thank you for being cordial with me and not jumping down my throat about stuff. You know, you guys are a great group of guys. Keep up the good work. I'll try to keep bringing you guys good content. I'm glad I ate before I came here. This is nuts. This is crazy in here. I gotta go up. That's a big tree. Wow, there's a lot of people. It's not the same without snow. It really isn't. It's gonna be different being away from home, but it's also very exciting. It really is. It's a lot of fun, you guys. I mean, you can see I'm having a lot of fun. This is what I'm looking for. Something in here, I'm thinking. Cameras, 
radios, boom boxes. So I've decided I will reveal this is what we used on Walking Street. We're testing it out right now. What is happening? I'm afraid. <laughs> I like the colors. I like the light show. I purchased it. That is the Bluetooth radio that I just bought. By the time this video comes out, we would already be dancing on Walking Street with this. Yeah, we made up some signs. We got a little dance competition we're gonna be doing. If you dance for seven seconds, you get 20 pesos. If you dance for 15 seconds, you get 50 pesos. If you dance for 30 seconds, if you shake your bonbon, if you cut loose, you know what? If you get your freak on, it's 100 pesos. 30 seconds, everybody, 30 seconds. <laughs> Miss Ann stopped by again today. There she is. Looking great and beautiful today. Good to see you, Ann. Very good to see you. Always good to see you. She's gonna be hopefully dancing and shaking her bonbon out here for us. Making some money. <laughs> How fun is that gonna be? You guys are gonna see it when it's all put together. Yes, sir! A couple of these other screens that they provide here too it's um one of the best performing videos at the time you can see by the thousands of views per month and it's a couple screens show you how many watch hours i have what is that 77,000 views maybe 7,000 watch hours in the last month now take that into consideration you need to have 4,000 watch hours to get monetized on youtube and at least a thousand subscribers so now I'm over like 7,000 watch hours a month. So once you get established and you get rolling on this stuff, you know, hey, it kind of just snowballs and gets going. Really exciting to see. I'm like, I'm in Christmas Wonderland here, you guys. Christmas Tree Wonderland. Nutty. Train's not running. Oh, you got a bum wheel on the on blue car here. Looks like we're in for a little repair today, guys. Oh man, I was looking forward to a train ride. God darn it. <laughs> this reminds me too much of being at home back west in a mall, in the craziness, in the loud. Yeah, no. I gotta get out of here. This is about all I can handle. It's about 40 minutes of this and I gotta go. I gotta get out of this place if it's the last thing I ever do. Cash machines. Banks. Nutty. So you're asking yourself, was he able to find everything you wanted? No, absolutely not. Absolutely not, everybody. Never can, right? Never can. Thank you to everybody coming along with me on this little tour to SM Mall. Didn't get everything I wanted, but that's okay. I had enough of the shopping experience for one year.
all right i'm gonna sign off now we'll catch you guys in the next one again thank you to all my subscribers thank you to everybody who comments i like the thumbs up you see how the alg algorithms are being affected how they're affected how the money goes up and down how the viewership goes up and down how the hours work how the analytics target my audience size uh, and demographics age location again fun i think it, I, I take it all as fun it's like a game for me so and i'm gonna win i want to win all right see you guys in the next one look at the stars you guys they're getting the stars done looks good looks good i don't know where the workers are today hell i don't even know what day it is again but you know who we got we got adrian here yeah, all right. got himself a shout out everybody yes sir and look so, at his sidekick uh, we got the beautiful ann hey yeah. <laughs> all right so shout out to uh don den and alex from uh washington state state capital olympia state bird american golfing state flower pacific road in john Shout out to Robert from Kansas, State Capital, Tupica, State Bird, Western Meadowlands, State Flower, Wild Sunflower. Shout out to William from Oregon, State Capital, Salem, State Bird, Western Meadowlands, State Flower, Oregon Grape. Shout out to Sheila Rose from Utah, State Capital, Salt Lake City, State Bird, California Gulf, State Flower, Sigo Lily. Shout out to Larry and Amy from Iowa, State Capital, Des Moines, State Bird, uh, American Goldpin, State Flower, Brain Rose. Shout out to James from uh, Connecticut, State Capital, Hartford, State Bird, American Robin, State Flower, Mountain Laurel. Shout out to Brian Hatcher. Shout out to Brian Kincaid. Shout out to Shane Phillips from Australia. Shout out to Greg's Outdoor Adventures. Shout out to Terry. Shout out to Shoestring Traveler. Shout out to Dave Sharkensy. Shout out to Focus in Asia. Shout out to uh, Gringo, AK Carlos from Florida. Shout out to Eddie from Pampano Beach, Florida. Come on Shout out to Kevin Aggie. Shout out to Guy Travels from UK. Shout out to Paul Crypto Guide from UK. Shout out to Edgar Cruz from Virginia Beach. Shout out to Mason Alexander Cruz from San Antonio, Texas. Shout out to Edwin Cruz from Diamond Subdivision, Angeles City, Philippines. Shout out to Anne from Calibu Aklan, Philippines. Thank you for watching, folks. <laughs> <laughs>